Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to enable the Windows Photo Viewer in Windows 11. This will also work in Windows 10. So if you remember back in Windows 7 when you opened up a picture it would use the uh, Windows Photo Viewer app and you could do a bunch of cool things from there. And starting with Windows 10 it now switched to the Photos app. So if you open a picture you get the Photos app by default here. And you have your little you know tools and stuff so it's not a bad program but if you uh, if you like the older version the windows photo app then you could uh, enable that by doing a little registry edit so what you need to do is you need to take this text here which i'll put in the description you could put it in a uh, copy and then put it in a new uh, notepad file but what you want to do instead of saving it with the txt you want to change that to reg to make a registry file and say yes and you'll see that the icon changes, so then you just need to double click it. Say yes to this, to the prompt. And it's going to ask you, do you want to import this registry file into your registry? You say yes. So it's been okay. And then just reboot the computer. You could probably just uh, restart the Windows Explorer executable, but might as well just restart the computer. Take about the same amount of time here. So we'll be back when that's restarted. Okay, so now that we're rebooted, you know, if we double click the picture, it's still going to open the Photos app. So what we need to do now is right click on the picture or any, you know, any file you could do this to open with. And you want to choose another app. And if it's not here, you want to click on more apps. And then you should have Windows Photo Viewer in this list. You can click on that and click OK. And now it opens it with the Windows Photo Viewer. And you could do things like, you know, copy, check the properties of the file, you know, print it, send it an email, burn it to a CD, open it with another program. So now, if you want it to open with Photo Viewer every time, when you right click it, click on Open With, and choose another app, go down to Photo Viewer, and then make sure you check this box that says Always Use This App to Open JPEG File. So this will just to for JPEG files. So if you have like PNG or TIFF files, you're going to have to do this the same thing for those type of files. You know, just pick any PNG file, right click on it and do the same process. So we're going to click OK. So now it opened it with the Windows Photo Viewer. And now if we just double click it, it opens it with the Windows Photo Viewer. Another thing you do is go to your settings and then to your apps and then default apps. And then scroll down to the bottom here, and then you could do choose defaults by file type. And if you want to find like a, scroll down to, already did JPEG, so we'll look for another type of image file like PNG, for example. And you could see it's set to open with the Photos app, and you could just click on it and change that to Photo Viewer and click OK. Now you'll see it change that to the photo view. So you can just kind of scroll through and find any kind of image file you want from here and change the uh, type to Windows Photo Viewer instead of whatever default app it's set to open with. All right, pretty simple. So like I said, I'll, I'll put a, the uh, text in here for the uh, registry file. Just copy and paste that into Notepad, save it as a REG file, double click it, reboot, and you should be good to go. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. <laughs>